Hey everybody, uh, welcome back to my channel. Uh, basically, I'm just checking in with you guys. Um, I know, I know, I've been gone a few days, um, and I'm still not 100%, but I wanted to try to explain something to you because my channel started to gain notoriety because of my um, feedback about uh, the NHS. And that was in comparison to um, the American um, healthcare system as it is. Um, and I have to say that recently I have been disappointed with the NHS, but I will explain. Uh, this is not me taking pot shots at the NHS while they're down because of the COVID crisis, I know, okay? I am well aware of the fact that right now uh, they're strained. Um, this is me mostly um, bitching at the dumb people who won't get the freaking vaccine. Go get your goddamn vaccine. Get it. Go get it done. I'm tired of listening to your bullshit, your excuses, your lies, your misinformation. Stop it. Just go get the freaking vaccine. Go. And I'll tell you why. Why am I mad? Hmm? Okay. I am mad because of this. I went and got my blood work done uh, for my diabetes. Fair enough. Went. GP. Got my blood drawn. No problem. They lost my blood work in the flood of everything else. Okay. I get a text from my GP telling me that they do not have any more of those little tubes to test the blood work. Because of the COVID crisis and because there are so many people that are showing up sick with COVID now. The only reason that disease is mutating so far, so fast, and so furiously, and so badly is because of idiots that won't get their vaccine, that won't wear their mask, and won't do what they're supposed to do. You know who you are. You know who you are. And you know what you're supposed to be doing. Stop making stupid excuses. Vaccines have been around forever, okay? They have been around for a very long time. Don't go back and say, well, forever. They were only around for, I don't, I'm not here for that, okay? I'm not. All right, we were all given vaccines when we were children. They were to prevent diseases that would have killed us and they were horrible. They're not just there to protect you. They're there to protect me as well as another member of the society. Who the hell do you think you are? You think you're so special? Oh, well, I'm not gonna get a vaccine. I don't need it. I do. I need you to go get your vaccine. Now. I need you to stop making excuses for your bad behavior. Grow up. Grow up. Face the consequences of your actions and act like an adult. Take some responsibility. I'm sitting here suffering, not just me. Who knows how many others are sitting here having to wait because of your dumbass, your dumbass, yours. I'm pointing at you, okay? I am pissed off because now they told me on that little text from the GP's office that I have to wait until they have more of those vials in order to come in to do my blood work. I wish I was joking. I really do, but I'm not. So right now, I'm just floundering. I don't know what's going on with my diabetes, okay? My fingers are starting to go tingly and numb and weird. I'm having issues. I'm feeling worse. I'm making the appropriate dietary changes. I'm doing the best I can to manage it on my own. But this should not be happening. Diabetes is something that I should be able to go get managed and get help for. But I can't because of idiots out there and I've heard them on the street out doing their little protests oh well, I don't speak to people that wear masks really dumbass really 
Do you think you're making some sort of statement that matters? The only thing you're doing is, like, basically, you're a blip in history. So am I, for that matter, really. But I don't want to die, you know, with my diabetic problem because you're too stupid to see the value of a vaccine. Okay? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Get your goddamn vaccine. Stop making your excuses. Stop sitting there thinking, you know, well, I'm not going to get my kids vaccinated, but I'm going to send them to school anyway. Because that's been happening too. And that's not cute at all. I mean, who the hell do you think you are? Seriously. All these people. I'm sick to death of it. I'm tired of it. I'm, I'm tired of just sitting here being calm about it. I've been feeling like shit. And I'm really tired of feeling like this. I already have enough to deal with, guys. I already have enough on my plate health-wise. Okay? You just don't know. You don't know. You don't see it. Maybe I should put on, like, some sort of webcam so people can see how much I suffer every day. You know? Not because I want to hear people say, oh, poor you, but I want people to see the reality of the decisions they're making because they're not getting their vaccines. I want you to see the consequences of your actions in just maybe perhaps one household. Who knows how many other households there are out there that are being held up because they can't get their surgeries done because some idiot didn't want to get their vaccine done. Some asshole decided they're going to stand in front of the store and make a scene because they don't want to wear a mask. You're a dumbass. And you're wasting everybody's time. You're wasting all the doctor's time. You're wasting the nurse's time. You're wasting everyone's time. People that could be doing research on diseases other than COVID. You know, they could be doing other things. Do you think nurses want to like work so many hours and get PTSD from watching so many people die because you're too stupid to get your goddamn vaccine? Huh? Really? What's your excuse? What is your excuse? I have honestly been sitting here seething with this. I've been, I've been sitting on this for whew, uh, a while. And then when I got that text from my GP, that was that was that was a straw right there that was it I couldn't do it anymore I couldn't keep my mouth shut I couldn't be you know nice I don't care if I'm palatable for people I don't care okay I don't all I care about is that you do your part as a member of society and get your goddamn vaccine get it get it done and shut up okay so, yeah, okay, the vaccine doesn't take as long to produce. That's because they've been making vaccines for quite some time. If you do the research, which I am under no obligation to, like, regurgitate to you, go read it for yourself, lazy, and go find out for yourself, stupid. And yeah, I'm calling you these names because I want to piss you off. I want to piss you off. I want to piss you off enough to get you up off your ass so you go to the doctor, you go to the hospital, you go to wherever it is you have to go and get stuck with that goddamn vaccine. Get it done. Because I, 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 can't, I can't sit here, you know? I have been imprisoned in my house because of my health problems. I'm afraid to go out, okay? I'm afraid to go out because I see people, they don't give a shit. They just walk around, no mask, even in the middle of the, the lockdown. You know, in the middle of the lockdown, I'm standing in line in a store and this woman is slowly walking closer to me, bit by bit, little by little. And I'm standing there just like, excuse me? <laughs> I, I, didn't, I wasn't rude to her. I wasn't cussing at her or anything. I didn't call her names, but I mean, I'm giving her the look like, uh, excuse me. She wasn't catching my hint. So I finally said to her, excuse me, but could you please back off? Uh, social distancing. There's, there's, there's even a thing on the floor. Come on, please. Because I don't want to upset people. But when you infringe on my life, when you infringe on my health, 
And I really want other people that their health is being affected by this, by your stupid decisions. I want other people to get on their webcam and get on their, on their mic. And I want other people to express their anger towards this ignorant, like, wave of anti-vaxxers. You know, just get it done. Stop whining like a baby. It's a vaccine. Get it done. I mean, do you have superpowers to fight COVID? If not, then STFU, which is shut the mm, up and get your vaccine, okay? Because I am the queen of the club of STFU. Don't even try to come for me, okay? Don't. Not on this. I'm really tired of all this. Now, for the people that have actually done what they're supposed to do, and some of you are still getting sick, it's because of the people that are not getting their vaccine. They're still allowing that disease to mutate. And it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a horrible disease. It really is. Um, I don't wish it on anyone. That's another reason why I want people to get their vaccine, just so they can be well and, you know, maybe continue to piss me off, you know, with their stupid opinions. Fine. That's fine. I don't mind that. I like a good debate. But don't risk my health because of this shit, okay? Don't. You don't have the right to do that to me. Any more than I have the right to do that to you, okay? I'm sorry, but... I mean, I have a whole other video that I'm going to be focusing on America. Believe me, I'm going there and I don't care about the backlash. I don't care what they think of me. I mean, I don't. I'm I'm tired of it. I mean, the state of things are just ridiculous, but I'm not going into that in this video. This is all about here, the UK. I love you guys. I do. I don't like losing my temper. I don't. Because it hurts me. If any of you are curious, do a little research on fibromyalgia, you'll find out that when a person that has fibromyalgia, of which there is no known cure, um, when their stress is raised, uh, they will usually manifest that stress as physical pain on their body. So when I get angry, um, stressed out, afraid, I will feel more pain than usual. But I'm really tired of just sitting here saying nothing. And um, to Gail and, and Saul and everybody else that, you know, just has stuck by me, please just allow me these rants because the world is insane. And somebody has to say something and I am going to be that somebody. You know, just like I am going to be that anti-Karen when I go out into the world. If I see somebody doing something they're not supposed to be doing, I'm going to be the anti-Karen in that situation and stand up for what's right. So, yeah. And, you know, I know it might be a little late to say this, but, you know, this is the Rainbow Room. I mean, honestly, you can come sit down, have a chat with me at any point in time. Just please don't be stupid about the vaccine Come on. I mean, you could go get a mullet. You could go, like, do anything you want to do other than that. Just about. Okay, I do have certain other limits. But, um, (laughs) I do. Uh, but just don't infringe on my health because you don't want to do something. And you have no real good reason why not. It's ridiculous. You can do better. I know you can do better. But it's really up to you. Isn't it? It's up to you. You have to do the right thing. And honestly, I hope I made you mad. I hope I pissed you off just a little bit. Because if it irritated you enough to go get that vaccine, then you're protecting yourself and you're protecting other people. And that's all I care about right now let's end this covid crap okay we we owe each other 
a life where we can live together, even if we disagree. But this has got to stop. You're hurting me now. Come on, think about all the people you might be affecting. Think about someone besides yourself, maybe. I don't know. <sighs> all right, well, to the people that follow me, thank you very much. Um, and I hope you'll continue to subscribe. Uh, I lost a, a few people, but you know, um, I would, I really had hoped they would be patient with me, but it's okay. It's fine. The good ones stayed. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm signing out. I'm going to go. Um, and actually, um, yeah, I feel pretty good about what I said. And you know what? Honestly, venting feels good. Yeah, everybody should do that. Go vent. I'm telling you, man, those little English phone booths that nobody uses anymore, soundproof those things, charge people a pound to go in there and just scream. Seriously, let your, like, anger out. You know, wash it down with some antibacterial stuff. Next. Because, you know, we all want to go scream and yell or just cuss somebody out, but we can't, you know, for propriety propriety's sake. So, um, you know, let's, let's have a little screaming box. I'm down. Are you? <laughs>